Yeah. Hello, guys. Um, let me check the dates because. <laughs> oh, and the sun is disappearing again. Uh, today is January 10th, and I am 32 weeks and four days. I didn't get to vlog on Sunday again. I'm sorry. Um, I actually vlogged a cooking video that day, and I completely forgot to do a baby vlog, which is weird. Um, but anyways, there's no more toothache, and no more sunlight again. <laughs> I got my tooth pulled, so there's no more discomfort in that area. My gums still feel a little bit sore in that area, but it's a lot better than it was uh, the weeks before that. So much better now. Um, I do have some discomforts this week. She's getting so big and so strong. So the more active she becomes, the more she starts to hit my ribs and my organs. <laughs> and the slightest movements hurt because she's so... My tummy is so small. Yeah, pretty much. And uh, Braxton Hicks is starting up quite a bit. Which is uncomfortable, but still very tolerable. It, I'm not in pain or anything. It's just difficult to fall asleep. Uh, she's very active, especially at night. So it's hard for me to adjust and roll over and do all that stuff. But aside from that, everything is okay. I had my A1C test today, which is an overall blood test for the whole month, just to check the, my blood sugar level. And I had very good results. It was a 5.1, which is way better than what most people with uh, diabetes or gestational diabetes get. Uh, usually you start to get worried when you have 5.6 or higher. And um, this is the highest test I've ever gotten and it's a 5.1, so it's good. I'm really sorry about the lighting changing a lot. It And the cat scratching on the thing. <laughs> I don't know, it comes and goes. But uh, blood sugar level is good, and despite being sick and being in antibiotics and all that, I was really worried about it. But everything is good, and she's active, and that's pretty much it for this one. Hey, let's go see how much she has grown in the last week. Hey, this week, Peanut is 16.7 inches long, apparently the size of a large jicama. I've never seen a jicama that long before. <laughs> And uh, she weighs 3.75 pounds. She's almost 4 pounds. Oh my gosh. That's so exciting. And this mushed baby looks like this right now. Only she's upside down. Right side up. Whatever. Her head is up here actually. At least the last time the doctor checked. And her feet's down here. So that's why she's kicking all this area. And it feels so weird. <laughs> she's so strong. And this is another one. Another better look at what she might look like right now. All she's doing is filling out. Get nice fat to fill out her skin. Now her skin is less wrinkled now and she is more pink. Hello! So here's the belly at 32 weeks. Bum, bum, bum. Big, big belly. Um, I started getting stretch marks this week. There's one right on top of my belly button. I think you can see it. I hope you can see it. And some down here. I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> Sorry, love. But, uh, yeah. There it is. Oh, my light disappeared. Every time I try to vlog in front of the window, the sun disappears. That's just rude. But yeah, that's belly time for 32 weeks. Getting there, getting big, getting heavy, getting very itchy, and misshapen. <laughs> it always does like a weird bulgy thing. 